Here's why the IMF and the World Bank, to me, will forever be facially and possibly neo-colonial institutions. Let's go into some history first. You essentially have the slave trade, which some actually argue was the foundation of the Industrial Revolution in Europe. Following that, you have a very intense colonial period where countries are being looted for their raw materials. So there was no focus on industry, save for being able to make railways and to be able to build infrastructure that would promote extractionary colonial goals. So now after all of this, there's clearly these countries that have been looted from and the countries that have looted. So in 1944, when the world came together at the Bretton Woods Conference to discuss the world economy, guess who was not invited? Several colonized African countries. Out of this conference came the IMF and what would later become the World Bank. So Africans were deliberately left out of a conversation that would impact the continent and the world at large.